is Ralph Irvin in the Valley, where Sunday night, 11th ranked UCLA took on number three, Cal State Northridge. After a scoreless and even 43 minutes of the first half, Reed Williams was able to earn a yellow card and a penalty kick. I only came in the last five minutes of the half. They just told me to pick up the energy and uh, just make some runs in the back. And there was a ball I saw Joe looking up, and I had him play over the top. And I was trying to spin the center back, and he had grabbed me with two arms. So I tried to spin him one way, and he was still holding on to me. And basically just held me back from getting the ball, and they called it. Leo Stoles converted, and UCLA had a 1-0 lead going into the half. It, the first half was a hard-fought uh, first 45 minutes and for us to get a goal obviously gave us some momentum and I thought uh, we had a pretty good half, not terribly dangerous, but uh, getting a goal going to halftime, you know, set the tone for us for the second half. In the 51st minute, Victor Chavez made it 2-0. I got a crossing from Ryan, I saw the defender pull out and as I saw him come uh, do that motion, I I took my, my chance and just got in behind him, got the header in. I, you know, didn't see the goalie, but he was off his line and I just popped it over him and yeah, got, got that in. A CSUN goal made it 2-1 until the 74th minute when Leo Stoltz hit his second goal, this one for Max Estrada. I was pretty far away actually from the 18-yard box and then I saw Max uh, Felix, he kept going and going and um, he fell on the ground and played the ball to Max and he laid it off to me and then I took one touch and finished. And uh, yeah, I was happy that I found the back of the net. Chavez hit the back of the net once again in the 85th minute on a pass from Felix Vobeda. I thought the guys did a great job of being the aggressor in the second half and I thought our goals were really good uh, in the second half. Uh, Leo Stoltz was instrumental tonight, obviously two goals, but uh, just all the other things he, he did for us, the service he provided and um, I thought he was really good for us tonight. After the loss last week uh, on Thursday, it was really important for us to win this game just for our confidence and yeah, we're happy that we won today. We want to finish our non-conference schedule with five wins and you know, we've won um, four games against quality teams and we need to be more consistent and you know, we will talk quite a bit about our mentality and make sure that we're ready to go uh, to play against Riverside on Thursday night. Once again, UCLA a 4-2 winner here at Cal State Northridge. The Bruins are back in action this week as they host UC Riverside. That, of course, at Drake Stadium. And, of course, the best news and notes on UCLA soccer. You did all right here at UCLA Bruins. Dot com.